How do you feel? Yeah, it's a good day. Do you want to do it? Let's do it. Are you sure? Yeah. Go on. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. I don't want to change my mind. This is serious shit. Oh, this is, ser this is serious. Let's do it. Are you absolutely sure? Yeah, don't keep asking me. Go on. You're going you're to put me off then, aren't you? Well, it's not. This is dangerous. Life threatening this. People, people are being killed doing this kind of stuff. Very dangerous this time. You can do it. You can do this. Come on. Do you want to stop? Do you want to do you want to change your mind? No. You're gonna do it. Yeah. People are telling me I'm mad for going straight for a, a Veltings crate. Why not a, a Weisteiner or or a, a, another beer crate or a milk crate or a, whatever. But it's got to be a Veltings. No one's done it before on a Veltings. Not in Europe. It's territory you should not be stepping into. He's not familiar with it. He will hurt himself. You've got to be careful. You don't... You don't do this lightly, it's not an easy thing to do. All I want to do is to be taken seriously. I'm serious. Seriously. So yeah, we're looking for this site. We need to find a good site for this uh, jump. It's a really, it's a special jump. This is uh, never been done in Europe before. We're, we're jumping off a Veltins crate. Never been done in Europe before. Never been done before ever. We've used they've used Brinkhoff crates before, but never an ad adaptive Veltins crate. Some people ask me, why a Veltins crate? Why not start with a Weinsteiner or a Brinkhoff crate? Nah, no, I want to go for the big one. I want to go for the Veltins. A Veltins crate is the daddy of crates. And this is dangerous and you shouldn't try this if you haven't been crate jumping before. It's foolish. Foolish to do this like he had done. It's no experience. There's no experience. He's foolish. He's not in thing to do this with the Veltins. He did not try a Brinkhoff. Should have stepped with a Brinkhoff or a Kronbacher or a Warsteiner. This is uh, this is foolish. 
You see, this man, this man is not doing this thing right. Just uh, don't do this. Leave it to the experts, yeah? Yeah. It's territory you should not be stepping into. He's not familiar with it. He will hurt himself. You've got to be careful. You don't, you don't do this lightly. It's not an easy thing to do. You're foolish. You should have started on the on a different, a different heights, a different grade, a different tension. Now. Strong, stupid. Yeah, that. Dumb cop. Yes, and dumb cop. Uh, this uh, is my biggest challenge so far. This. I've done lots of lots of different things before. Like uh, I was in a a quartet. Uh, I was in a group before called Il Debo. Oh yeah, El Devo. That's a different chapter. It's something that you have to wait for. Devo, Devo. The curious thing about El Devo, we're all called Dave. It's quite unique. Classical. I wanted to do rap, but classical. I'm not the best singer in the world, but they think I'm Italian, so I just went with it. Being a pop group. I uh, played musical instruments in the pop group, not like these uh, make-believe characters that you get on X Factor. I was a proper musician, me. I've done instructional videos for DIY. I've been a, a stand-up comedian. Yeah. An independent singer. So much. There's loads. What? I've done everything. I've done it all. But this, this one is the big one. Yeah, it's the next challenge. It's, it's the big one. Hang on a minute, I've seen something. Good one, but it's not right. <laughs> the funny thing is, I'm not called Dave, but I wanted to get in the band, so I said my name was Dave. <laughs> Everyone knows who I am. I'm Icky Lee. Icky R. Lee. Nah. It's not right. No, it's not right. Come on. Everyone knows I'm Icky R. Lee. Okay. This is it. We'll come back here when the weather's right, I think. Yeah, not right today. Yeah, this is it. I was in a band once when I was younger. Uh, I was a drummer. But I wanted to specialise in the triangle. Oh, I can get you one just like it. I can get you one just like it. Trust me. And then we got a manager. I was going to take him all the way, because he had star quality. He had star quality, it needed tapping into. It went all down in from then on. He was a good boy, he was a really good boy, very talented, very talented. I think he wanted to keep it in the family. His daughter was in the band, her boyfriend was in the band. His nephew was in the band. He, he was like a member of my own family, you know, he was like a member of my own family. He wanted us to sign a five-year contract. We were like the best friends and I wanted to make all these dreams come true. But everything, all the costs came in first before we got anything. It was a really good deal that I offered him, a really good deal. We were supposed to get something. Well, not necessarily for him. But I didn't get anything. Not a penny. I'm a businessman, alright? I'm a businessman. And, uh, you know, there were expenses. 
I questioned it, but they said I was being uncooperative and I had a poor attitude. Obviously, I had to look after my own affairs and my own family. And uh, Icky, he decided to go his own way. So they let me go? Yes, it was a long time ago. It's true, it was a long time ago. I don't remember all the details. Uh, it went something like that. So they let me go? Look, I, uh, I hear he's uh, singing with Il Devo now. Is that right? Il Devo, yeah? I was really gutted. Tell him to ring me, please. Tell him to ring me. Because we were all mates. What, you like my shirt? Right? You like the shirt, yeah? And get you one just like it. Trust me. So then I was approached by a guy called Lee. He was promoting a band. He wanted me to do some music. He was promoting a band called... Blue Fridge. Uh, I always did my best for everyone I worked for. Um, for up and coming talent and, uh, and anybody who I work with, uh, I would go to great lengths to help talent on its way. I did it then and I'll do it now. And I'd always put other people's interests before my own. Blue Fridge, yeah, that was it. Blue Fridge, yeah. Yes, they, uh, they were really exciting days. Uh, really exciting. And I wanted Dicky to help us out in the studio, you know, to add his, his magic to the album. He's triangle magic, you know. Really good. Some kind of acid house, garage, country, western, ambient band. He wanted me to do my triangle stuff on some of the tracks. It looks easy, but it's not. Yeah, it sounded good. Yeah, we couldn't pay him, so I promised to put his name on the album as a guest artist. I knew that there were no payments, but he promised me promised to put me on the, the album as a guest artist. So when the album was released, my name was nowhere to be seen on the cover of the album. All that triangle work, hours and hours of graft, all those tears for nothing. My name was not on the album. Let me think. Um, oh yeah, yeah. Uh, it was a mistake at the printers. Yeah, we were gonna we're gonna get some more more inserts printed, of course. Yeah. Oh, we should fix it, you know. So I rang him up. I pointed out that I had a letter from him, promising that we were going to do great things together, and all that. But. He just said that that was nothing I could do and put the phone down. What? Well, he's got it in writing. He's got it in writing. Yeah. Now oh, it was years ago. Who cares? There's nothing I can do. <laughs> anyway, these things are sent to make you stronger, I suppose. That's why I'm I'm doing this, doing the crate jump. I've I've excelled at other stuff, and now I want to be the best at this. Yeah, do you like do you like the shades? The good the clip ons actually they're quite convincing, aren't they? Yeah, I got them from Specsavers. Yeah, 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 they're good, aren't they? Yeah. I got some of them flip up ones. Yeah. We're getting a biscuit with this tea. Yeah, some with chocolate on. Yeah. Anti-clockwise. Yeah, thanks.
this is it. We'll come back here when the weather's right, I think. Yeah, not right today. Yeah. How do you feel? Yeah, it's a good day. Do you want to do it? Let's do it. Are you sure? Yeah. Go on. Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. I don't want to change my mind. God, you're right. You're right. Are you okay? Icky, yeah. Icky, speak to me. Oh, you're right. Oh, get me stay there. I'll get, get me help. Me first I'll get help. Icky, Icky, Icky. Yeah. Mm. I, I brought you a drink, look. I brought you a drink. Uh, You've got to have a drink, so you've got to keep your fluids up. Uh, How are you feeling? Is you know, you're okay? Uh, what what did you say? Uh, is there anything do you want what do you want? Do you need something? What what is it? What do you want? Can I have a chocolate biscuit? Mm, yeah, Alright, I'll go and get one, yeah. Mm. I think I might put it there for you, next to your drink. Are you okay? Have you got everything you need? Are you sure? Yeah. Are you in pain? Yeah. Okay. Look, uh, do you want any more cushions or anything like that? Yeah. Are you look are you are you are you comfortable? Well, I make a living.
Trust me.